I'm having my first glass of wine postpartum. How cool is that? I was like, no way. It's so delicious. It's so delicious. <laughs> so I bought a ton of stuff. Look at the frills. Like, tell me this is not gonna be such a cute brother sister moment. It kind of was a big deal for us. Hey guys, hello, welcome back to my channel. Welcome back to another vlog. I just finished editing my first vlog, like back. Kind of from um, the last vlog I put up before that was, was my labor and delivery vlog. Um, and so I started vlogging again, you know, postpartum, and I just edited and uploaded that today. So I figured I would start a new vlog, and I think I'm just gonna like kind of have like running vlogs where I'm just picking up the camera when there's anything relevant going on, and then just like compiling the footage. Probably be like weekly vlogs or something like that. But I'm right now making some um, risotto with scallops, which I'm very excited about. I'm having my first glass of wine postpartum, got a nose itch, which I'm very excited about. It's cold Moscato, which is like one of my favorites. Ken is upstairs giving Cole a bath, Emily is sleeping, so it's like quiet down here. And I'm just cooking, having some wine. I got Gilmore Girls in the background. And I got some mail I thought I would like open. I feel like this vlog is gonna be a little bit of like a haul type vlog. I have baby clothes, new stuff for me. I actually just got, I don't know if I'll, be able to show you. Can you see this um, gigantic hair clip? These are so big. I just got these off Amazon. It was like a four pack for like six dollars. It was like crazy cheap. They were like a dollar each almost. I think they were on like maybe a little sale. But they're nice and like I mean they're big. They're they're pretty big. But I have just a lot. My hair's not like thick, but I just have a lot of hair because it's so long. And so most clips like don't hold my hair very well like I have to adjust them a lot or like I have to really squeeze it in so I was excited when I found these because these are really good for long hair thick hair like if you just have a hard time with your hair like staying in a clip so I will link these down below like I said they're from Amazon and they're literally like a dollar each so anyway I am getting this risotto going I have to give Emily a bath after dinner we just got in from a nice little walk just me and the kiddos Cole is actually like a little bit sick he just has like a cold I think his nose is just runny he's just like not feeling ideal however he got his flu shot at the pediatrician a couple of days ago so I also don't know if maybe like he's feeling weird because of that you know you can kind of have like some side effects I'm not sure he's just not feeling the best um but we got him down for like really good nap and he seems in much better spirit so yeah I'm just gonna do I think like some hauling in this vlog I feel like we haven't done that in a while so Stay tuned. Okay, it is a different day. All my vlogs span like a couple of days, kind of like I mentioned, they're just kind of whenever I can sit down or like I have something like worth sharing. I have little miss in her little docket right here. So if you hear like some squeaking, that is her. We're having like such a cozy little Saturday morning in. It's like kind of like rainy and like getting cold finally. It's getting cold out. So we're having such a cozy little morning in just like with the kiddos and having so much fun. But like I mentioned um, earlier in this video, I kind of want to like show y'all some stuff in this video. I have, like I said, stuff for me, stuff for the kiddos. And I actually have like, I haven't done like a clothing haul like for me since I was very pregnant. I did like a maternity haul obviously. I probably did a couple. But I have like new clothes, like a bunch of new clothes. So I'm going to probably do that in a separate vlog because I have, I have so so much stuff to share now that I'm like not pregnant anymore I'm like excited about buying clothes again and stuff and I don't think it's gonna fit in this vlog with like the other stuff I want to show so that will be a separate video but I'm very excited I have so many new goodies mostly just like cozy stuff because we're postpartum and it's like fall and winter so that's what we're about so what I wanted to um, show y'all real quick while I'm sitting here because I keep it downstairs since it's definitely something to have handy especially for me with a newborn and I am exclusively nursing right now I definitely plan on introducing like pumping and stuff once my supply is a little more established once she's a little bit older and stuff like that but mom cozy actually sent over their lactation massager and they're actually sponsoring this portion of today's video of which I am so freaking excited to be working with them they actually have and it's so funny right when they reached out literally like that day I had been on Amazon looking at their nursing bras because I've just heard their nursing bras are like everything um, and I do have a couple pairs of those so I'll show you those in the like clothing haul because I feel like that makes a little bit more sense but they have like other things besides like wearable nursing things and they have this lactation massager and this thing is so clutch and frankly this is gonna come in so handy for me because last time around I got a lot of, I didn't get like my or anything, but I definitely had experiences with like clogged ducts and like just like discomfort and literally the only thing for me that helps like relieve that 
is a like massager type of tool. I've never had anything quite like this though, so this is gonna like change the game for me this time around, like as a second time mom. This thing is so cool, and I love this color. I think they have different colors. Of course, I'll have this linked down below for y'all, and if I have a coupon code or anything, I will put that down below as well, but this thing is amazing, and not that I'm like looking forward to needing it, <laughs> because I'm like usually uncomfortable and in pain when you need something like this, but when it happens inevitably, because it will, at least for me, I'm so excited to have this. It comes with the cutest little storage bag too, which I love. And this is what it looks like. And when I tell you the second I took this out of the package, I literally was like, to my husband, I was like, oh my gosh, you need to feel this. This is like the most insanely soft. It's kind of like the NARS like packaging, you know, but it's like a thousand times softer. Like, I don't even know how to explain this. It feels like a butter soft. This is insanely soft. And this is the coolest tool. I've literally never seen anything like this. So innovative. So it has um, a charging port, obviously. This needs to be charged. It obviously comes with a charger, which I'm just storing here in the bag. But this thing has so many different functions. So it obviously turns on and it has a massager feature, but then also just kind of like a heated vibrating feature as well. So when you use the like on button, as you can probably hear, it vibrates and it has six different like levels of vibration. You can adjust it just with the on button. I don't know if you'll be able to like really tell. It has different kind of like low, medium, and high, and then this is kind of like a pulsating, and then this is like a faster pulsating. So there's a lot of different like vibrating functions, and the vibrating feature is kind of in like this curved part, so you can kind of just work out, you know, wherever the clog is or like whatever's bothering you. You can kind of use this like curved edge, like around the breast, and it is so handy, but it gets better than that because not only does it vibrate, but you can heat up that area of the massager. You can see here there's three different levels of warmth and it warms up right here in this curved area, which for me, heat was huge. Like I literally needed to use a massaging tool and then like a hot water bottle or like a hot pack that you microwave. It was a game changer for me for helping get like anything clogged out. So this vibrates and it warms up. So you like literally just need this one tool instead of multiple things. I literally had to like dock up with so much stuff before and it has the different heat settings for whatever you're comfortable with. But then if you like really need to level it up, they have like a literal massage. Like it feels like the massage chairs that you have in like the salon when you go get a pedicure. You use this button and check that out. How cool is that? And it has three different levels of that too. So you can kind of adjust that to what you need. And obviously the heat's not up here, the heat is down here. So this is just for like the vibration and the warmth. But if you need like a legit like massage, you can adjust how fast this is going. And then obviously you can adjust like how much pressure you're actually like putting on the area by how much you apply it, like how hard you apply it to yourself. How cool is that? It literally feels so nice like I feel like this would be super effective if you need something a little bit more maybe intense than just like the vibration So this is the coolest like kind of three-in-one product, but it's also like nice and small Oh my gosh, it's like nice and warm in this area I'm telling you all this is the coolest thing ever I guess I can turn off the heat now But this is such a handy kind of like all-in-one little product You can keep this in your nursing cabinet You could like keep this in your diaper bag or like even if you just carry a bum bag Like even if you're not going out with the kiddos like this is so small But if you're actively like working on getting a clog out I feel like you need to have stuff like this with you kind of all the time because it get very uncomfortable very quickly I've been there the battery on this should last like two to three hours so again like if you're bringing it with you it should be it should have enough charge for you to like go out and about or do whatever you're doing and not need to like worry about it dying when you need it the most and you can also just use this as like a kind of a general tool whether you're like clogged up or not obviously the whole function when you have a clog is to try to like get the milk flowing and like get that out of there but you can also just use this like in general it doesn't have to be for something like a tragic like a clogged duck you can just use this to kind of help with milk flow if you're feeling like very engorged or you need to kind of like get things going when you're about to feed your baby maybe overnight and stuff like that when like you go longer stretches this is something you can just like whip out to kind of just like help move things along and just kind of like make you feel a little bit more comfortable like i said the heat setting is so great and then you have the vibrating option and the massager option so whatever you're needing or if you're needing like multiple things you can switch between all three of the settings i love that and it's honestly just so cute like the aesthetic <laughs> i just love it so this is the perfect little thing like i said i will have it linked down below for y'all i think like this will also make a really good gift for any new moms in your life or like expecting moms for like a baby shower or something like that this is the kind of thing i feel like that you don't have until you need it and then when you need it you're like desperate and you cannot get it soon enough so this is just a really great thing to have in advance of breastfeeding just like in your breastfeeding caddy or your cart or whatever just to have because like the second you need it you need it i love this i am so excited to have this kind of like in my arsenal for when the time comes so i'll have a link to down below if you guys to check out definitely recommend it if you are like about to be a mom and you're like oh i probably won't like you will need this at some point i'm telling you you will need it even if you don't get mastitis or anything like that like you will just come upon a time where something like this comes in very handy so thank you again so much to mom cozy for sponsoring this portion of today's video like i said i will show you guys some of their um nursing bras and stuff in a different video but 
I think I'm being summoned. Also, the reviews of this are literally so good. So I'm not just saying it, it's true. It's so good. Just opened this um, package. My girlfriend, my best friend from back home sent this for Emily, obviously, from Etsy. And I just opened it and plugged it in. And it's like the cutest. I'm literally obsessed with it. I just like, I'm not gonna keep it in the kitchen, obviously, but I just plugged it in <laughs> to try it out. And I'm obsessed. Yeah, we're documenting this for the vlog. We've spent a good portion of our life trying to get Cole trying to go? interested in cheese sticks. Oh, <laughs> you just climbing on dad. Where are you trying to go? He likes shredded cheese, but he's never liked yeah. cheese sticks, and we would love for him to like cheese sticks because hello. So good, like in terms of just dairy and protein and all that. And he's never even touched one. And then all of a sudden today he was like sick, wakes up and just munches an entire one. He's and never even looked too. in the direction of one before. I had the bag, and I was like, oh, you, you want the bag? Well, you always offer him one. Like and then I opened it, and then he seemed interested, and I gave him one of them, and then he tried to eat it out of the plastic, and I was like, no way. No way you're eating this. I mean, yeah. Heck yeah. Is this what happens? You just got to get a flu shot, and all of a sudden you figure out good oh. food options? It's so delicious. <laughs> it's so delicious. <laughs> <laughs> Look at you, strong girl! Skin to skin with that day. <laughs> okay, so Ken is putting Cole to bed. Emily is sleeping here next to me. Oh, I turned all the lights on in here, but I feel like, okay, there's the lights a little bit there now. I got this big old box from Monica and Andy. I purchased this stuff myself, but they had like this huge like warehouse sale. And this box also it looks like it's like busting at the seams. Uh, but they're having their like warehouse sale. And I swear everything was like 80% off. It was like a really good sale. Oh my gosh. So I bought a ton of stuff, like a ton of stuff. So I don't even like feel like I can haul this. Is this even even in focus? <laughs> so oh, are you getting cranky? So I'm like super excited to unbox this because I've been waiting for this order for a couple days and I can't wait. But I feel like it will take me literally like 30 minutes <laughs> to unbox this and like individually show you every single thing. And plus I want to show you all other stuff in this video. So I think I'm just gonna like go through and either I'll speed through this footage or I'll just open it and like give you an overview of what's here. Cause it's a lot, but I'm so excited. So I'm gonna unbox it. I'll just speed through. I don't even think I can link this stuff up because a lot of it was like quickly selling out. It's like their warehouse. It's not even on Monica and Andy's regular website. It's like their separate warehouse website. I feel like Little Bipsy kind of has the same thing, like almost like a separate site for their like sale and clearance stuff. So anyway, I'm not gonna be able to link all this stuff, um, but I will link just like the general warehouse website in case they have like a similar deal or sale going on because this stuff is so cute. Like look, can you even, look how cute. This is a 12 month, just like little romper, but look at the frills on it and like the pink piping and then there's like buttons in the back. How cute, and then there are like buttons down here for diaper changes. Oh my gosh, so cute. And all this stuff, I don't think there's like tags or anything, was like 40 or 50 bucks full price. And almost everything was like six or seven bucks. Some things were like four bucks. Insane sale. And the quality of this stuff is, I mean, I'm sure you'll have probably heard of it, but the quality is just so good. Like even just touching it, you know how you can just kind of tell when things are just like nicer. Super like stretchy, but also just like really, really smooth and soft and like breathable, but comfy. This is mostly stuff for Emily for the most part. They just like seem to have more girl stuff on this site or at least like in the sale section than boy stuff, but there are a couple things for Cole. So let's do this. Oh, actually, this is like one of the few things for Cole. How freaking cute is this pair of swim trunks? This is a 3T. Even their tags are like nice. It's like, not just like a regular tag, it's like a linen material. How cute are these little swim bottoms? <gasps> oh my gosh. Also cheers, and yes, I'm having a second glass of wine because I haven't even had any wine until today, you know, since like a year ago, so cheers. So this is um, a little like set 
This is like a little terry cloth. I mean, this could be like a swim cover up or honestly this could just be like a cute little like summer set. But it's got like a nice cotton on the inside, a terry cloth kind of material on the outside. And I actually got the matching little shorts to go with. I was thinking cute is that? This is like a burp cloth, how funny is that? This is literally like a dollar or two. And I thought it was just funny because it had pizza on it, but it's very small and it's very thin. Oh my gosh, this for her for next fall. <gasps> Again, it's like so stretchy, but also like so soft. Look at the ruffles and the leaves. Does this stuff look big to you? This is 12 to 18 months. This looks like it would fit like my son right now and he's two. Well, he's like a big two year old. That would be cute kind of like Easter vibes. Again, I just love these sweatshirts with the ruffles. And this material is so nice. It's got like a little bit of fleece on the inside, like a very thin kind of fleecy lining, but really soft and smooth on the outside. I love that the piping on like the kind of waistband and then the wrist and the collar all matches. The quality of these just seems insane. Like these just feel so nice. Oh wait, I had to do this. I had to. I'm literally taking any opportunity I can to have her and Cole match, you know, while I can get away with it. So I saw <laughs> this little freaking swimsuit. I mean, can you even? It's like a little um, kind of like a racer back little swimsuit with the <laughs> like citrus on it and it's got the little kind of skirt. Are you good? Cutest little swimsuit. And then I saw they happen to have, that'll be for her for next summer. So I got for Cole for next summer too in a 4T. The matching swim trunks. Like tell me this is not gonna be such a cute brother sister moment. I'm gonna have to give Ken like a little haul <laughs> when he comes down because even though he doesn't really care about this stuff, I love just getting to like show him the cute little things that I get for the kids. This, I like could not resist. This is like the cutest little bubble. It's like just like kind of a lightweight like linen material for the summer, but it's got like kind of like a little bit of frills on the like thigh portion and then look at the pockets. This was just like nothing else, you know, like just with like thighs coming out of it in the summer. So cute and I love the purple print and actually I just realized I got this little headband, which again, this was probably like a dollar or two, and it matches um, this little outfit that I got. But also, obviously, she could just like wear this by itself. And I could not pass up this little dress. How cute is this with like the checker print, and it's kind of like tiered. Like it's got like a little kind of ruffly area at the bottom, and then the little puff sleeves, and the little square neckline. I cannot. And then I actually got them each a pool towel which I might put this like with their Christmas stuff um, just because why not? The like terry cloth outside isn't particularly soft but like the non-printed side is pretty soft and this pattern matches those swim shorts that I got cold so there's like pizzas and like floaties and pineapples and popsicles and stuff so I thought that would be cute for Cole and then for her I got the towel that matches um, that little set that I got her, so cute. Hello y'all, it is not the next day. <laughs> I don't even remember the last time that, I think it was two days ago that I started this vlog. Regardless, I'm um, up in Cole's room getting his outfit for the day picked out. I'm kind of at like a place where I can kind of like get him dressed and stuff. I can't lift him up onto like his dress or like do his diapers and stuff, but he's cooperative enough that I can like bring his clothes downstairs and get him dressed. But I wanted to share because it was kind of a fun, very like, I post on Instagram. It's like a little thing that was a big thing this morning. And Cole and I, so Emily stayed here with Ken and he just had her in the carrier and she was sleeping anyway. And it was so nice because I haven't been able to drive. They don't let you drive for like two weeks after a C-section. So I got cleared to drive on, was it Friday? I want to say now it's Monday, so I was so excited and Cole and I just went in the car, we drove to Dunkin', got a coffee and actually tried their loaded hash browns, which is just like a new thing that they just put on the menu I really wanted to get and we just took a drive, just the two of us, 
while Ken stayed home with the baby and we listened to Christmas music and it was just like the simplest thing. We even like stayed in our PJs. Like I literally wore my PJ pants and my slippers and he just had like his PJs and no shoes on. And it was like the simplest thing. We were probably gone for like 15 minutes, 20 minutes, but just getting in the car and being able to drive again and just like going out with like just Cole, the two of us kind of like how we used to and just grabbing coffee. I can't like lift him in and out of the car seat. So I can't even take him anywhere because I can only lift up to 25 pounds now and he's 40 pounds. So I can only take him places where like we're doing like a drive through or a curbside pickup or something like that. Like I can't go anywhere that he has to get out of the car by myself. So it was so nice, even though <laughs> I'm still like so limited in what I can do. It was so nice just getting to like go out with him, just the two of us, listen to some Christmas music, get some coffee and just like get out of the house and drive and like kind of do something on my own for a second for the first time. So anyway, I didn't even like think to bring the camera or to vlog or anything, which I um, probably should have because it was like kind of noteworthy. I know again, like it sounds so like not a big deal when I say like, oh, me and my son went and grabbed coffee, but it kind of was a big deal for us and it was fun. So anyway, it's still literally in the 70s here in the South, even though it's freaking November. So we're still doing like t-shirts, but then like sweats on the bottom because it's like a little chilly, you know, but not like cold. So anyway, I just thought I would grab the camera and mention that. 